I've never heard this, but this is Emily Lingi's cover, I hope I said the name right, of Crazy, written by Willie Nelson. About 70 years ago now. This is Floyd Kramer's piano version, and it's so classic. Crazy. Mm. I'm crazy for feeling so lonely. Ooh, I love the vibrato on the breath there. I'm crazy. Um, vocal bend down. Crazy for feeling so blue. Mm. So there, she was up in her head voice on feeling so blue and then switch down into chest that's how you add dynamic interest early on in a song without creating a huge volume differential I knew nice you love me as long as you wanted ooh that there's that breath on the vibrato again at the end of wanted and then someday Somebody new. So there are some very subtle things she's doing here to create this timeless classic sound. Some, some. She's singing on the consonant there, which is very classic 1940s, 50s. And then she echoes the grace notes in the piano arrangement vocally, which would be somebody new, da -dum. There's a lot of these little da -dum, da -dum in the piano arrangement, and doing it vocally is a really lovely subliminal pairing to that. Worry, da -da. Yes. Why do I let myself da -da. Grace note. Grace note in the piano. Love the walk up. What in the world did I do? Head voice note there. Relaxed. Perfect pitch. Love the gravel tone in her voice when she switched to chest there. Right there too. My love, super classic style, and so perfectly matches the da dum da dum in the piano. Could hold you Gorgeous. I'm crazy for trying. I'm crazy. Cray. For crying. Really digging into that I'm R. Crazy for love and da -da. I bet my friend Charles Cornell would have a thing or two to say about this piano breakdown here. Gorgeous technique with the crossovers on the left hand. Brings me back to my piano lesson days. Gorgeous articulation and arpeggiation there. I love it! I love the piano interlude! Modulation. For thinking that my love da, da, da. There it is again. She's very consistent on that, which is great because you expect that in this song. Patsy Cline did the same thing, made the song famous. Only thing I wish she would have done was instead of try yen, crazy for trying, instead of try yen. If she would have kept her tongue a little flatter in the back of her mouth, the sound would have continued all the way instead of semi-stopped. We'll listen to that one more time so you know what I'm talking about. I'm crazy for trying. You hear that there? Crazy for crying. She did it there too. Could have been a little more open. Love the bend up to the end. Dun, 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 dun. Little grace notes everywhere. Hear it? That's a grace note. Mm. This was such a blessing to my ears today. I loved you, Emily, and I've never heard you before. 
If you've never heard before, show her some love and subscribe to her channel on YouTube. And if you're a singer who dreams of posting cover songs like this, join the Tara Simon Studios app today by clicking the link in the description box below, where you're not only going to level up your voice, but you'll be an official member of the only social media for singers in the world.